your local weather authority with Chief Meteorologist Jesse Walker. Hey, welcome back, everybody. I wanted to show you temperatures all across the country. It is really warm across the nation's midsection. You can see these temperatures all the way up here to Minneapolis at 84 degrees. It's warmer there than it is in Dallas, Texas, so the warmth is advancing northward. Now, out here where it's chilly, that's our developing storm system, which will impact us as we head into primarily later Wednesday and into Thursday. And I also wanted to tell you about the uh, space station. Anytime it flies over, I want to give you a little heads up. So tonight at about 8.57 Eastern to about 9.04, so this is a long, like, seven minutes. A lot of times we don't get that many minutes. It'll start out in the west-northwest, it'll go to the southeast, and it'll be about 66 degrees at its maximum height, so it'll be up pretty high in the sky. So if we get a chance, we should be mostly clear tonight, again, slightly before 9 o'clock to about 9.04 Eastern time, west-northwest to the southeast. You'll see the space station fly over. Always a good thing to check that out, and I think the weather will be okay tonight. 77, the high, beautiful weather today. 48 has been our low. No rainfall across the area today. Not expecting anything until probably later in the day on Wednesday. There's your sunrise sunset times for tomorrow. We're approaching 13 hours of daylight now, and the river stage in Terre Haute still going down just under 10 feet. Right now at the airport in Terre Haute, beautiful. 76 degrees, winds are southwest at 11, pressure 29.95. These are the temperatures out there. We're in the mid 70s, so we get some really nice temperatures. And our next storm, I talked about where it was cooler out here. That's our next storm right there. This will actually move in here later Wednesday, and we'll track that for you in a second. In the meantime, there's not much going on west of the area. We've had a few clouds to the north of here today, and a few of those clouds are drifting in. So fair skies during the evening hours, and we should be looking at mostly clear during the overnight. Nothing showing up. Dorset, automotive, Doppler radar remains clear out there. So here we go. There's that storm way out to the northwest. So we'll time that for you as it moves in. We may catch a few showers in here on Wednesday morning, but they would be mostly light. Most of our rain will hold off. This is Wednesday evening. Probably some bigger storms to the southwest of here, Missouri and Arkansas. But even by Wednesday evening, I think most of this is going to be just to the west of this area. So most of our rain comes late. The wind will pick up tomorrow from the south, and then it will pick up again as we head to Wednesday. But that's tomorrow afternoon, maybe 15 miles per hour. But notice by Wednesday, we're talking maybe 18 to 20. So it's going to be breezy both days, but more wind, I think, on Wednesday. And the threat of severe weather Wednesday is mostly southwest of here, and that's a very low marginal risk anyway. So right now, it does not look likely we're going to see much in the way of any severe weather in the immediate area, and mostly southwest of here, it looks like. So here we go. Wednesday night into Thursday, rain chances. That should leave. So here's Friday morning. So we should be dry during the day Friday. Another system rolls in on Saturday. So it does look like part of the weekend. Saturday could be wet. That gets out of here. It gives us some dry weather as we head for Sunday and into the day coming up on Monday. So a couple rain chances in there, but not a complete washout for a few days. Temperatures are going to be nice and mild, although with the storm that comes in late week, it'll cool us off a little bit. Then there'll be another system, as you saw, coming on Saturday, and it cools us off some. Now, this isn't real, real cold, but I did want to show you the idea as we head into mid-month as you see somewhat cooler weather moving in. So it's nice and mild now, but when we look longer term, this is now the 13th to the 19th, so a little bit below normal. So it's, it's warm now, but I do think we're headed for somewhat cooler weather by the middle of the month. Forecast tonight, partly cloudy mild, dropping down to 54. That's it. Tomorrow, beautiful. 80 degrees. It'll be breezy but sunny. And then after that, rain chances as we enter into late Wednesday into Thursday with a high of about 65 degrees on Thursday. Chance of showers on Saturday, but Sunday looks good with highs back near 70. That's your forecast. Sports coming up right after the break. Base heating cooling.